Hey guys, and welcome back to Crypto Mischief. Richie here, where I talk about my favorite thing in the entire world, goddamn cryptocurrency. We have two big announcements to make in this video. I'm gonna explain some new uh, developments I have with the Mischief Airdrop Miner. The first one is going to be about mirror pools. What exactly is a mirror pool? Well, it's written right here. The MAM TVL is mirrored into DeFi. Mirror pools sustain the TVL. They sustain the MAM, right? So how am I sustaining the MAM with mirror pools? We're gonna do that first. Then after that, we are gonna talk about something else. And that is, we're gonna talk about the launch of the Shitcoins Lottery, which is gonna be on the 1st of October. You're gonna be able to compound your stake, right? Inside of the MAM to earn yourself tickets and also fresh deposits will also earn tickets. There'll be one mega winner every 24 hours or 1000 tickets earned, right? So that will be starting on the 1st of October. Making this video, we're uh, September 30th, so you still have time to check that out too. Uh, so let's first get into the mirror pools. I'm gonna show you some analytics for the MAM and we'll talk about how it's doing. It's doing pretty well in my opinion. And then we'll get into a little bit of breakdown of the lottery too. So first, mirror pools, okay. Right, so my idea behind this was that um, I didn't want to touch the TVL that's locked inside of the DAP, so I thought I could use the potential of the TVL and mirror that, yeah, with my funds, uh, therefore just staking into some of the DeFi platforms which I talk about and that I believe in and I trust, and then use that interest to feed back into the TVL of the, of the passive income DAP. So let, let me show you how I'm doing this, okay? So here we are in the MAM, right? MischiefMinder.io, link in the description, of course. So as I said, we are looking to maintain this here, which would be the TVL. This is the TVL of the miner. You can always check this, right? This would be the amount of referral rewards given in the form of miners or shit coins, right? Not in BUSD because I want it to be sustainable. We have 132 investors so far, which is great. It's growing every day, going up. And we have here a game. There's 13 bucks in here at the moment. I'll show you how to, that will increase. And we'll also have here the lottery balance, which will be coming once I open it, right, on the 1st of October. We, you will notice some things are changing in this stat. We have now airdrop 345 drip to Team 3, which is amazing. That means 345 drip bought off PancakeSwap, sent and locked into Faucet. So we're, we're changing up, right? The referral will be raised to 16% the weekend following the launch of the lottery. So that's something else to look forward to. And finally, under that, we do have the investment dashboard, okay? So you can see here what's going on, right? Um, with uh, this would be what I would call the mirror pool, right? Because it is my uh, stake into the miner. So let me be very clear about this. I don't ever plan on pressing this claim uh, button, right? As you can see, we can come and see the stats on this. I have 41,000. S coins in here. I have deposited in 5,680 yeah, dollars or BUSD. Total deposit plus compounding has been 7,469. I've withdrawn nothing, right? Uh, referrals, 19. Yeah, one referral, don't know how that happened, but <laughs> great. So what I'm doing is I'm funding the TVL by investing into a, a wallet, right? Which I plan to only compound, right? which is, I think, better than putting it straight. I could, if I wanted to, I could inject this capital, which I'm putting into the TVL, just straight into it, right, without actually opening up a mining account. But I think that this is a better way to do it because if I was just injecting capital in, it would just be boosting everyone's APRs and making people tempted to claim out uh, even more than they are. So by doing this, I'm actually controlling the APR by being a little bit of a whale inside the system. Right, so I'm kind of regulating it, right? If it gets uh, too much, I'll probably just start going straight into the TVL instead. Then I just would leave this because it has a bucket, right? Cart, 48 hour bucket. Essentially what would happen then if I just didn't touch this would be that uh, the value of S coins that I have would slowly be worthless, right? For example, if you think about some big miners like the Drip Garden, uh, if you just didn't touch your Drip Garden for ages, right? Then eventually, you know, the amount of uh, plants that you have would be worth nothing compared to what people have been doing that have been investing in compounding, right? So it's not much of a big problem really. And as I said, I will not be pressing that claim button. This is uh, capital I'm putting into this to sustain the project. So where are these mysterious mirror pools, right? Let's come over to one of them and we're gonna show you what I'm doing, right? So here we do have a, a Grizzly Finance, right? So I have a position here in BUSD and BNB, $1,000 in here, and we have some uh, Grizzly Honey that I've earned, 74% APY, 
and we have to kind of continue to build this up. So for example, I'd come in here and I want to take uh, another, yeah, one more BNB. We want to add another BNB from my funds, right, to the mirror pool. Now this is an ongoing process. I think I need to have quite a large amount of capital in this in this uh, for it to actually work very well. As you can see here, I'm putting in $283 into this uh, stick here. I'll show you the other sticks I have for the mirror pool. Yeah, so we come here, I come over to Grizzly and then I would just add in there that 263, I believe that was. 263, right, add it in there. I Earning now up to 1,382. You can see if I zoom in here, we have other mirror pools. I have entombed $29,000 of Bitcoin. We have $3,199 of ETH and some BNB with BUSD2, and that's earning me out funds. Uh, I will claim the funds, then I will deposit them into the mirror pool. So, you know, we can come over to Tomb2. This is the account with um, the Bitcoin. Genesis, right? So I've put the Bitcoin in here. We're earning 5% uh, per year on it. So that's me earning now $32 to go into the mirror pool here and another $10 with the ETH, which I've earned. So combining slowly building, right? So this is going to be a, a bit of a slow process. I'm um, using other uh, funds from other DeFi projects as well, just to uh, get it kickstarted, right? So you're going to see over the weeks and months at the moment, we have investment of 33,000 in the mirror pool, but it's going to be raising to 50,000 to 60,000, probably eventually 100,000 or 200,000 in the mirror pool, earning APR, which will then be earning tokens, which I'll be selling into BUSD and putting back into the TVL of the Mischief Airdrop Miner. Now, this doesn't mean that the BUSD balance will not fall. Um, I think that's kind of impossible, <laughs> to be honest, if only one person is uh, sustaining it. So compounding and of course, referring others to get involved in the miner will help it much more to be sustainable. This is just uh, my effort to make sure that this pays out for everyone that's involved, especially people who are part of the community that watch my videos uh, every time I put them out. Because I think that's a great thing, right? We're in the bear market and we have something which I can use some of the power of the projects I talk about and I vouch for. Why the hell should I not be using them to actually sustain a project that I'm running myself? This is just my kind of logic, right? So that's how we work, you know? Coming to some analytics on this, we can, uh, let's just refresh this. Um, this was made by at big518. Thanks very much for creating this for me. This is a June analytics site where we can look at the health of the miner. I'll link this in the description. You can check it out. So you can see it has a contract value, $24,000. We have 132 users. We have uh, fully staked, was, is, has been $55,000, which means already $31,000 has been paid out to uh, stakers, which is amazing, right? 55,000 staked in. 31,000 paid out. It's awesome. Uh, it means that almost, you know, everyone is getting close to their ROI as we're going on. You can see here the total users building. We have uh, starting day 167 and picking up roughly five, yeah, five to around about four to five. Yesterday we picked up eight new wallets uh, coming into the miner, which is good. I want to see this. I just want to see steady growth. I don't want to see explosive growth. I want to see a nice steady growth on it. The TVL, as you can see, we're on a little bit of a dip at the moment. We managed to maintain initially at 30,000, but as more people are beginning to uh, get their ROI, which is great, we are seeing the TVL falling. But to be honest, that's okay because the man has mirror pools and the mirror pools will find balance eventually. This is what we're, we're aiming for balance. We're not aiming for a rocky road here. So you can see the past four days, we've seen a drop from 26 to 24, uh, just, just, just under 25, right? So not huge drops in the TVL, being very sustainable, running quite well. So come check this out. Please give me a star over here in the top right hand corner and you'll get to, you know, you get to just watch the, how we're growing and how we're doing, because it's very important, right? Very important to know the health of your miner and this is the best way to check it all out. Um, coming into then what we're doing, right? So the plan is now from the first in two days, I will be turning off the, uh, shitcoin sniper game, which is this one here. This will be stopped for a while, probably about a month, um, meaning because I want it to sustain, right? Sustainability. While we turn this one off, we will be turning on the shitcoin lottery. Lottery will run every 24 hours or if 1,000 max participants has been reached per round. 20 tickets max per user for each round, 100 BUSD equals 20 tickets, okay? 5% of each deposited or compounded amount will be put into the rewards pool which is capped at 1,000 BUSD per round. So the maximum you can win from this lottery is $1,000 uh, paid out in S coins. Five BUSD deposit equals one ticket, right? Uh, so that would be a compound, right, of five BUSD. So for example, here I have 127 BUSD. I would compound that, I would get my tickets for the lottery. I'd see my tickets here, 
right? And then it will give my percentage chance of winning the lottery. Lottery, again, drawn daily or per 1,000 uh, participants or ticket holders, right? 90% of the total rewards pool will be used to buy S coins and be sent to the winning investor's address and 10% will of course stay in the contract because the house always wins, does it not? <laughs> so this will be starting on the first and as I said, the weekend following the launch of the shitcoin lottery, we will be turning uh, maxing out the referral bonus to 16%. In other news for the man, the YouTube competition for the best video is closed. I now have Weibo who's gonna watch them all and give me the three winners. One winner gets 400 bucks, one winner gets 100 bucks, another winner gets a crypto mischief NFT. The NFT designer is at work. I have paid him and now he's working at it. Um, it will take him a roughly a month or two to get everything ready for that, which is great because our, our roadmap is coming along nicely. We are, right? Launch of the miner, done. Mirror pools launched, done. Then sustainability is the aim at the moment. Onboarding, continuous onboarding by opening the lottery, building up their fro bonus. Then we will have the launch of the DGEM Farmer Spreadsheet V2. Here's a little sneaky peeky at what we're working on. Um, I'm not going to give too much away though because it's all a lot of code in the back end, right? It will be self-populating your wallet for five top projects plus one which will be voted on by NFT holders. So that's exciting too. The NFT is steel right now at 0.0125 ETH. It's only 16 bucks because ETH just keeps on going down. We have 240 NFTs sold at the moment, which is great. We're almost close to that 250 sold. And in terms of the mirror pools, so I have one in Grizzly, I have one in Tomb. I'm at a little bit of a, a gap here at the moment. I'm either gonna go for a trading bot for another mirror pool, uh, in terms of maybe I might choose the token Optimus, but it's high risk. Uh, I might just use a trading bot myself, or I might open up a Furio account, or possibly I might go into the Drip Garden also. Um, different ways which I know that can actually make me pretty good returns in DeFi to build up the mirror pool. But always safety is best, so the majority of funds will be in kind of low APRs, but as I start to build up the mirror pool into larger and larger deposits, the amount that I'm going to be able to supply into the airdrop miner is going to be fantastic. Using the power of DeFi and my own personal wealth to sustain my Ponzi. <laughs> okay, I have been Richie Crypto Mischief. Uh, thanks and watch out for the launch of the lottery, which is going to be happening very soon. Peace. Don't get wrecked.